Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Don't Starve. And we are having... Oh, it's a pretty bad day, all told. And we're suffering from rain exposure. I think what we're going to do is we're going to run up here and get ourselves some more flowers. Get ourselves a, a parasol if we can, because... We are not going to last very long with this sapping our sanity so incredibly badly. We'll grab these bushes on the way through as well. And as you can tell, we are starting to freeze, which is not good. Okay, right. Let's let's deal with this problem first. Eat that. Right, let's get a fire going. And stick the fire here. Okay, day 17. It looks like winter is coming to us early. Um, I think all we can really do is weather out this rainstorm at the moment and see what we can do afterwards. Right, well, I shall bring you back in after that. Right, the rain has stopped, but we are suffering pretty badly, and what you are hearing in the background are the sounds of dogs, which is just going to make our life so much easier here. We're going to need to be ready to step in at a moment's notice and fight. So, right, I think we can step away from this. Yeah, okay, right. Let's do this. First of all, helmet, spear, body armor. Looks like we're going to be helped out by some pigs here. Okay, there's one down. Excellent. Right. Store that. to make ourselves a bit of space here I think. Right, restore that, restore that. Get ourselves a harmless weapon. There we go. Now we can start picking up some of this. Oh, get away from these spiders I think. But we definitely need these flowers. So let's grab them. Well, that went pretty well. Oh actually what have we got? That's enough for another garland, so let's grab all these. There we go, got these, let's come back down here and pick up our spoils. That gog tooth is very important, it looks like the meat is gone, I can live without it. Right. Okay, how's our sanity doing? Right, our sanity is fairly good, it's recovered from all that mindless violence, which is great. Let's just stand by here a second. No, that's not helping us. Okay, let's push on home. It's coming up to winter now. We are on day 17. As you could see, it was getting cold while it was raining there. We're really going to have to start worrying about that. Nope. I deny you that poop. And... We'll have to start thinking about the biggest problem over winter, which is food. We're going to lose all of our vegetables, which is not good. But to counterbalance that, uh, we've got plenty of rabbit trapping possibilities, and I've been saving up the naughtiness quite deliberately so that uh, you know we can survive as much as possible over the winter on on rabbit meat alone, which is going to make for some. Well, we're going to be sick of rabbit by the time spring comes around, but we will probably still be alive, and that's the important thing. Okay, we are in the right direction. Slightly bit of a detour, but that gained us two carrots, so I'm not complaining about it. I think we're probably going to make it back to base by sunset, if not. 
let's get ourselves a fire just down the bar there so we can put it down whenever we want of course the nice thing about Willow is she carries a light source with her at all times so that's not really a problem are we going the right way? we are going the right way uh, should be running into lots of frog ponds and I think this is going to be my next area of interest here I want to get um, a load of traps down here get some fishing done let's make the most of that while we still have it and we're here just in time let's get a fire going just in time for sunset marvelous and standing right next to the fire there is going to push our sanity back up right well I'm going to do a bit of inventory management overnight you don't really need to be around for it and I shall see you all in the morning okay right welcome back um, it's morning our sanity has recovered a little bit overnight, stood on the fire, and quite literally stood on the fire. Uh, we've got plenty of berries here, which is great. So let's grab as much of this as we can. And uh, One thing I do wish there was a, uh, in this game was that if there was a way of remembering the rotation of the map when you save and and quit because I want it the way that I want it and I particularly want it this way round at this point no, that's our slow sticks another marvelous resource that's going to help us through the winter there's all the traps we can make with this stuff so we've got a bit of replanting we want to do today and then we're going to do some in a little bit more inventory management and then I think we're going to go hunting for some wood because we desperately need some but look at all this lovely lovely stuff as you get this picking and then we might actually get another harvest before winter which is the reason why I'm concentrating so much on this at the moment right, get this one as well there we go right so what do we need to do we need to start thinking about winter clothing because it's day 18 we seem to have slipped today I seem to have done a four day episode but I shall well I should just carry on regardless and keep with the three day episodes as much as possible. Right, let's have this tree down. Um, thank you. And then we'll Oh you're still full, are you? Well let's let's start planting some trees, shall we? Pick this stuff up. Uh, we'll put you there. Have this stump. Uh, where is there is my shovel? Right, and let's go install some of this stuff. Yeah, I think one of the things we're going to need at this point is yeah, we're gonna, definitely going to need another chest. I believe these ones are full. Change the fishing rod so I don't accidentally. Oh no, there's a bit of space left in there. All right. Okay, so store some poop. Store that. Uh, hound's tooth. I uh, don't need the rot at the moment. We'll save that till after winter. We'll save a stack of cut grass because we've got so much of it. Um, yeah, that's, that's all the space we've got there. So, right, we've got nearly two stacks of twigs, which is great. Let's do a bit of harvesting here. Okay. 
Okay, yep, we're back to bunnies, that's a good thing. Okay, and this last one. Alright, these traps are all going to need replacing next time round, but we've got plenty of glass on that now. Oh, it's Chester, I wonder what it was. Okay. There we go. No extra fruit. But we've got plenty of stuff here. Okay, now. How are we doing for food? Okay, let's eat this. Alright, and. Put one of these to dry. Put one of these in the pot. Put one of these in the fridge. And we'll. Add some fruit to that. There we go, that's enough. Get that cooking. Let's get these birch nuts planted. We're going to start needing those very soon. Uh, there we go. Right, one there. Brilliant. Right. Might even see those before winter, but I doubt it. Okay, so that's small food cooking. We've got some meat drying. We've got some extra berries, that's great. Get that cap, yeah, get the garland equipped so that's slowing down our sanity loss. Um, store that. Looks like we're going to need to use Chester for storage. Where are you, Chester? Oh, there you are. Hiding from me. Yeah, you've got beard hair already, so you can store that. Oh, we'll have that meat. Uh, what can we give you a return? All right, let's give you a stack of twigs. Like that. Okay, that'll do. Um, better get that light fire lit. Not that it's so important with Willow, but I like to get it done, and let's just get this all stored. There we go. We'll start drying that and cooking that fairly quickly. Okay, our inventory is a little bit more organised. And there we go. Let's get ourselves a nice sanity healing fire going there. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this pickaxe and then we're going to come up here to our Alchemy Engine S and Survival, I think it is. We want to make ourselves a Thermal Stone. There we go. We've got everything we need for it already. Brilliant. That is fantastic. And as we stand on the fire, that will heat up automatically and that will help us as it's starting to get cold, which reminds me... Science... Thermal measurer. Okay, we're going to need planks for that, but we'll make that fairly soon. That's a good. In that's a good help for us to to know when winter is running out. So there you go. You can see the thermal stone is heating up already. Okay, we've only got a little bit of light left, but I don't want to do anything really in it. So I'm just going to stand here, soak up the the heat and sanity, and I'll see you all in the morning. Right, it's morning, and uh, it's, the days are getting shorter, so let's make the most of the time here. Uh, let's get something cooking, so we'll have a bit of that. We'll have some monster meat, and we'll stick two berries in. No, don't drop it. So is it slightly better than just eating it? There we go, that'll do. And get that cooking. Okay, we've got plenty of food, we've got plenty of hit points. We don't have anything here, so what I think we're going to do today is we are going to, let's see if we can find a decent one. We're going to come down here and quickly, just have a quick forage through this area. There's an unexplored block there. I'm going to pay a visit to that spider, see how much spider silk we can get. We need six pieces of spider silk at this point. Um, I know there's spiders up here somewhere but that seems a bit far for me to go at this point. I'd rather have one that I can harvest quite quickly. On the way back we'll see what we can get out of 
these fishing ponds here. I've got a little bit of uh, life left on a fishing rod, so we'll use that. And we'll also armor up and kill any frogs we see. So that's going to give us a nice big chunk of meat, which we're going to have to start uh, drying and processing as quickly as possible, especially seeing as we are now on the cusp of winter. Which is quite terrifying, really. This has gone so fast. But... Uh, we've got a fairly good start, I'd say, this time around. Um, certainly, the ordinary monsters are not a fear for us. I think we're going to survive winter now, unless we do something disastrously stupid, which is, let's be honest, always a possibility. Uh, it's behind us to southwards. Uh, hello! Hello! Ooh, I'll have your poop before we go. Okay, and I may as well. Thank you very much. I'll have that. Okay, let's go and deal with these spiders. More poop. Yay! Okay, so let's have a couple of traps and we'll pop these. Let's put one here. Yeah, and we'll put one here. And then let's get some spidery attention. Grab some poop. Thanks, you. That'll do very nicely. Thank you very much. Grab that one as well. Marvellous. We're going to lure you. No, we're not. So. Let's put this trap here. I said put this trap here. Come on. Come on. This is a nice big spider's nest. We're going to get loads of stuff out of this one. There we go. And. Yeah, he's lost interest. Let's make ourselves a third trap. Oh, good lord, would you believe it? I've run out. Ah, no, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's do it anyway. Let's just replant that. Okay, and we'll go back to equipping our fishing rod. That way I don't accidentally dig things up. I'm Ventry space is becoming a massive problem again, as it always is. Right, don't need that. Don't need a hammer just now. There we go, that's giving us a little bit more space. Not much, but a little. Loads more lovely spidery activity. Come here, you. Come on. We need six spider's webs in order to make the Presta Hattitator, and I really want to make the Presta Hattitator. Come on! Oh, there you are. That's marvellous. Another web, brilliant. Set that trap, let's see if we can get someone into it. Come here! Stop showing independent thought, spiders. Come attack me. Hello. So, I think that's all we're going to get. A um, little bit of poop on the way by us. Don't mind if I do. Now you attack me. Of course you do. Right. Okay, let's just get back. That's... Oh, that's three pieces of spider web to... Uh, monster meat, that's all very good. I'd like some spider guns as well, but you can't have everything. And I'm quite happy what we did get. Okay, so here we go. I've missed those, but to tell you what, let's wear out this fishing rod. Okay, and the next. And that's two fish. fish. Oh, there we go. There we go. 
I accidentally double clicked. We'll dry this out quickly, I think. And um, we'll cook what we can. Another fish, excellent. Uh, let's go to a different pond. Don't have much left on this. We get another three fish, I think. Um, there we go, that's all the time we have, so let's get back to base. Assuming we can find it. Yeah, nearly there. Sounds like we've got some bunnies in the traps, we'll get those tomorrow. And it looks like we got here just in time. Well, there you have it. Okay, I think that's three days. I've got a little bit thrown off now, I've got to be honest with you. Um, but... Uh, we'll carry on with the three-day routine all the way through the winter because it seems to work quite well. Uh, I was hoping to use up that fishing rod because once things freeze over, it's no use to me at all. But... We might not get the time. But anyway, we shall pick this up in the next episode. So until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Don't Starve. You thought I was going to say Plants vs. Zombies, didn't you? Thank you, and good night. <laughs>